come on in. Hi, it's Friday. It's Friday. That was creepy. It's fine, whatever. Hello, it's Friday and it's Labor Day weekend. I'm so excited. And I got a horse. You guys, I have not had my own horse since I was probably Steel's age. And it was a paint horse. And I have another paint horse. I'm so excited. Like a little kid. I'm 36 and so excited. What, what is happening? Let's get some skincare on. Uh, I got my shower and I went to sit down. And I heard something. And I caught my brother's cows eating my horse feed. I had fed them, but only one horse was there. And so I had to run the cows off. And come back, you guys. Oh, so good. Got some, hold on. I always do this, and then y'all ask me what I did because I forget to show it. Climate control's always first. Then I did microbiome. Everybody needs the microbiome serum. It might be my favorite product. Next is in the serum. C. I am obsessed with the new microbiome, you guys. I had a zip pop up like right here the day I was coaching my son, and he was crazy. And I literally put that on it, and it was gone the next day. I swear by it swear by it. it never pop and never nothing it like it's a probiotic for your face kind of like you know how we worry about the good bacteria and the bad bacteria in our gut it's for your face to balance everything it works so good and then that is neotite under my eyes we're gonna get some skincare on microbiome um daytime moisturizer you know what i don't like about this is i can't see oh i can never mind i can see where i'm at we're almost done i have been wearing this one all summer well because it was new and it has sunscreen in it so it's got an actual SPF in it. Not that I'm going to be in the sun today. You're headed to Orange Beach. That's fancy. That's exciting. Oh. Who else is going, Melissa? Like, just your immediate family or the babies? My kids are laughing. I'll throw their skincare on, then we're going to go make a coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee. I always am, like, rubbing stuff on the back of my hands. I forgot my powder again. I also need a new anti-wrinkle. Let's go make a coffee. I already made my trim. I've already been drinking on it, but I made my espresso earlier and just realized I forgot to actually make the coffee. So we'll make a seven brew coffee cat. I got my overalls on today. I love these overalls. Y'all, it feels like fall outside. I don't know how it feels where you're at, um, but it feels so good right here. Like it feels like straight fall. So excited about that. Okay, there's our espresso. We're gonna do half a pump. Yeah, that was almost a full pump. A French vanilla. And then this is caramel. This is the copycat for the blondie. For the old blonde. Once you realize how easy it is to make these, you'll never go back. I'm totally lying, you guys. I had seven brew like maybe yesterday. No, maybe not yesterday, day before. But it will decrease the amount of time you go. So this time I ordered and um, Walmart sent me coconut milk. I love this brand. Last time it was almond milk. Previous, I'd been ordering, I actually ordered oat milk. Oh, what? What? You like my outfit? You're my spirit animal kid. Brooklyn just walked in. I'll try to order you something similar. She just walked out of her room and is like, <gasps> like gas, because she saw my outfit. She's literally my spirit animal, you guys. Like, legit. The kid understands me. My fashion. She always wants to be looking cute and like bright. She does not want to wear black. Okay. Don't forget when you're making a coffee at home, the big ice, okay? If you have the choice of big or little ice, the big eyes and then swirl it around swirl it around and then a little sweet cream hey hey i'm on live and you don't yeah will you get me a lid though where are you going she's in her pajamas room i was like no 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 don't run over here oh look at it would you just look at it and you can get these cups on amazon i have a link for them you gotta have the lid. Oh no, Brooklyn. Look at this. Ugh. So good, you guys. 
Um, I have this on my Amazon storefront. These cups are life changing. Mm. So good. Mm. I'm telling you right now, if you don't have the cup, quit making it in your stainless steel. I love water. I love making mixed drinks, your stuff together, but coffee, no. All right, I guess I should have. No. What is going on? I don't know what's happening, but I've got on my Agave Sky shoes, the, the um, cowhide, cute pink um, overalls, you guys. I just love these. They're like the shark bite. They're so good. We have them in khaki, too. I think I need the khaki for the fall. So, I can start wearing them with, like, long sleeve shirts, but as of right now, it's still, like, a little muggy out there. So, we'll be wearing t-shirts. I mean, tank tops. I don't even know what I'm talking about. So, did y'all see my post about the horse? Chase, totally. He went to ride a new horse. To try a horse. He's been wanting a new one. And he went to try Wednesday with my dad. And I had already told my dad. Chase had said we weren't going to get the horse. Because we were trying to find a horse that Chase could ride. Um, and I fell in love with this horse. We were not looking for me a horse. I really don't need a horse. Um, but. So I wanted Chase to try this horse. And he didn't like him. He was way too slow for him. And I got on him and loved him. And I've seen videos of him. With like a, I don't know how old the kid was, probably 10 or younger. I was like, oh, he'd be perfect for seal when he's ready. So I fell in love with him. Well, anyways, Chase was like, I just don't like him. And we, he didn't want to trade in his horse for that one. So I told my dad, sell the horse. Because I'm not in a position to buy myself a horse right now. We just bought a camper, remember? So, and I bought something else that y'all don't even know I bought. That is behind the scenes that we are working on. So there's no money for a horse. Anyways, so I told dad to sell the horse. Chase doesn't like him. Because Chase was going to trade his current horse for a new horse. Like we weren't spending more money if that makes sense. Anyways. Wednesday he went to try the new horse. And I was like, was the paint still there? And he was like, no, he's already gone. Which I totally believed because this horse is like gorgeous you guys when you see him in person he's he's bigger chase's gray horse was big this horse is bigger stouter oh he is just so pretty and he is a blue roan paint i love blue roans and i love paints he's literally the combo of my two favorite horses and he's like a little bit white but it's really kind of creamy so we bought a new camper not a brand new camper. Um, it's actually smaller. We bought it earlier this summer. Maybe Memorial Day weekend. No, no, no. The weekend is Steele's birthday. Maybe July. Chase found the camper that we've been looking like, looking for for like four years. We got lucky and um, it was a situation where someone had passed away. And so it was in a trust. And so it got sold for super cheap. And so it's the camper we've been looking for for a long time. It's smaller than our other camper. But much better. Much better. So we bought that as like our anniversary present to each other. <laughs> and I do. I really like it. Um, we stayed at the, like the whole time. In it. And I don't know if you remember the stories from all of our other years in the camper. But like we just didn't stay. Because I couldn't shower and stuff. I can shower in this one. It's totally fine. It's a little tiny bath shower. But it works. Mmm. You guys, there's some good stuff going on. Um, free shipping with Ebby. I keep forgetting to talk about Ebby. Um, I need to put my link in here in case anybody needs any bras. Oh, I forgot to have that live link. I need to update that. I used to be really good about this. They completely changed this. So if you have my old Ebby link, you guys, this changed in like January and I did not realize it. And so I kind of like screwed up. So, I don't know what my actual code is or if there's even a code on this new one. I think you just use the link. But the free shipping should just automatically happen. Um, I was shopping today because they've got a new, like, crisscross bra, bra I'm going to buy. So, if you're needing new bra or panties, you yeah, know, I swear by um, Evie. So, I'm going to put that link there because they're having, like, a Labor Day free shipping sale. Um, so, that's exciting. I love free shipping. So, do some makeup, friends. What are y'all doing this weekend? It is looking like it's going to rain. 
Um, it is definitely looking like that. Fair concealer. Honestly, I probably need to switch to light, but I really like it bright. Yes. Well, we're going to hang at the lake. So that's the thing. So Chase traded his horse in for a new horse and then he bought me the horse. Um, they have to be fed twice a day. So we're actually just going to like, it'd be nice to have the camper out there. We're not going to really be staying, um, but it's nice to have it during the day and stuff. So yeah, our camper is out there. If we stay the night, we'd have to, we have to get up super early and come home because we have to take care of the animals. So, um, that is the Grande, um, Shandy sells it. So if you want some, let me know. It's Grande Lash. It's also my Amazon storefront, but I use the color medium. I love it. It's super easy. It doesn't grow your brows or anything. It's just a color. Um, and so then I go and I put our gel. This is the Capixel, which is the Cinegent gel um, that has Capixel in it. I said that backwards. It holds them in place and it helps grow them. So I love that. I use those two things for what I use on my brows every day. Um, sometimes I'll use brown, black brown eyeliner. That is more tedious. Like if I'm going somewhere and I want like a bigger, fluffier brow, I will use that. But honestly, most of the time I'm too lazy for that. All right. It's like Labor Day weekend, but a little bit ew out there. So we are going to, I'm going to show you how to like glow up your face. So we put our concealer on. Um, I love a brow gel. Yeah, so that color is an actual gel, but the gel I love so much. And you can also do the gel and then add color, whatever you prefer. Y'all, you want to show you how to glow it up. If you're not obsessed with our pearlizer yet, it's my fault. I probably use it, but don't talk about it enough. It is so good. So I'm doing the pearlizer first. It has a little bit of coverage. You could literally throw this on at the pool or at the lake and just go about your business. Look at that. It gives you that, like, natural, healthy glow. I don't normally put it all over my face unless it's, like, a summer thing. And then I do. So, you won't see me do that in the winter. You'll just see me put it here. But you're going to see when I put my tinted moisturizer on, which is what I'm going to do next. And I only did, like, a little bit. You could do, obviously, way more. But it gives you that J-Lo glow. It's so good and so healthy. Yeah, I tried so many. In fact, like, if this one, I need to just throw that one away. Look at this one. I saw people on Instagram using it. This one was nasty. Straight nasty. Don't try that one. Let me tell you the brand. Do not get this one. Kaya, do not get this one. It was nasty. I hated that one so, so much. All right, so we're going to go for that, like, healthy glow because it's a lake weekend. But it sure looks like it's, it looks like it's pumpkin season and versus a lake weekend. But I'm like, no, it is lake season. Dang it. Or Lake Weekend. I was going to sleep in, but I didn't. So here we are. I got a lot done already. So um, I went and fed the two new horses because they're in a different pen. Came and fed the other horses. And when I got back, the kids were awake. And I've been on the phone all morning. So um, time to like get up and get around. This is the deep. So I use light to medium on my face. This is the deep color corrected tint and moisturizer. We're going to throw it on. And this is not the brush I always use. But I cleaned the brush I always use. I do like this brush. For right here. It's so good. I'm so excited. Did you know about the horse, Stacy? Did you know about him? Last night. So here's the funny thing. I was so annoyed with Chase. He calls me. And he's like, I'm on my way home. Are y'all still at soccer? And I'm like, yeah. Because he, he said he was going to the barn to try that new horse again. Which we got to name him. Um, anyways. He was like, are we going to go eat? And I was like, yeah. Um, I'll tell Taryn to call Kyle. And we'll, we'll go to dinner with them. It's almost over. And he's like, well, can you him get me? Which is kind of normal for him. He wants me. I like, we'll come home and get him. So I was like, okay. So I left soccer practice. We were going to Two Familia. He didn't tell you. Came all the way home to get him. He doesn't say anything. But I, like, at the corner of my eye, I see what I thought were horses at my mom's. And I was like, you're crazy. And so I looked back. I was looking at traffic. And then he was, like, smiling. And I looked at him. I was like, is that a horse down there? 
And so, he's so pretty, Stacy. I'll let you, you could ride him. You're going to love him. I originally wanted to name him Garth. And Chase was like, you should, no. I said, uh, Morgan. Like, let's name him Morgan. And I was like, oh, people think he's a girl. They won't get the whole Morgan Wallen thing. So, I was like, let's go with Garth. And Chase was like, well, what about Brooks? And I was like, well, we could do Wallen. So, I'm in between Garth, Brooks, Morgan, Wallen my favorites but there were some really good names on the elite group so i gotta come up with a name but i am so excited like a little kid what 36 year old woman is excited about a horse like a horse to just ride i don't like you know do anything right heather like we all want to sleep in but it just doesn't happen i forgot to tell cheryl hillary i was gonna sleep in is what happened but i was awake enough when she called me that i like it didn't wait like I didn't wake up and answer it, but then I was like, "Ooh, okay." I'm turning my Wi-Fi on because maybe the weather is getting bad because it keeps saying slow connection. He didn't even tell you. He doesn't trust you. You know that now after the whole cake in the face. But I'm so proud. Have I met my daughter? About what? What did I say? I am super sad though. So Chase traded in the gray horse, who was not a horse I was ever going to ride in public. Uh, Cause he's just too fast for me. But I was super sad about him selling him. Isn't that weird? Brooklyn cried because my dumb butt was like, "Chase, he's part of the family. Why don't you just buy a new horse?" Which obviously we all know why, because they cost too much money, and then you have to feed them, which is more money. It's pouring at your house. It looks nasty here, but it hasn't yet, y'all. I'm going in with pink peony hydromat for my cheeks because we're wearing beanie today. Where's it? Is it raining at everybody's house? It's not raining here yet, but it sure looks like it. Are you saying because I'm so excited about the horse? I mean, she's eight. She's supposed to be excited. But am I allowed? I was like, here's my phone. Take my picture. And Brecklin was like, I went in. Which, to be honest, this horse knows the barrel. So, Brecklin probably will ride the horse. And um, when Steel gets ready for... Look at that. I put a blush on my forehead. Oh, yeah. I look... I do not match the weather. I look like a holiday freaking weekend. And it's nasty out there. It's raining in Sterling. It's not raining here yet, but I have a feeling it's coming. Um, but still we'll be able to rope off him when he gets ready. And if Brecklin ever decides, like, he is the perfect kid horse, which is why he's perfect for me. And he's just so big. Oh, it's dry since Geronimo. Oh, you're on your way in. How weird. So it's dry. It's raining north of me, south of me, but not here. Not raining in Sorrel. Tell me where you are and if it's raining. I know we need the rain, so I will not complain. But I was super excited about Labor Day weekend. But I'm not going to lie. I could go to the barn and ride a horse. <laughs> I was like, I have to get a saddle. And Chase was like, nope, your dad got a saddle. There's a saddle in the um, trailer, which I haven't even looked at it, which you know me. I'm sure it's just like a basic saddle. I'm going to have to get a cute saddle. Right? I need a cute saddle, don't y'all think? Like with some color on it or something. But I don't have a clue what kind of saddle I would need. So, to talk to my dad about that. And he will be like, are you kidding me? <laughs> uh, Stacy, I'm pretty sure that my husband said that my brother is going somewhere this weekend to try to qualify for the American. So, that's exciting. We will definitely have to get tickets. Also, oh my gosh, you want to hear Stacy? Is your passport up to date? Not raining in Frederick. I got Chase's passport out today for that cruise. It's expired, so I'm going to have to get online today and try to, like, mega rush it. It expired in April. Brenda, I agree. That's what I was thinking. I was like, it is so pumpkin weather. I think that's what I called it earlier. I was like, it is, like, pumpkin weather out there. It is not lake weather. That is for dang sure. I gotta get some food and stuff. So Tanner can cook me dinner. And then hopefully Philip cooks us. What time are, what day are you coming, Stacey? And we'll see if Philip will make smash burgers. Those were so good. Are we gonna start carrying tack? Christy would be okay with that. I can't tell if my kids are playing or screaming. Can y'all hear them? It sounds a little rough. A soup in the crock pot? Mmm. That could be good. 
I don't have anything at home to like actually make or y'all shocked. You don't have a new one either. So what's going to happen if I can't get traces? I was just going to switch you to my plus one. Surely I can get it updated. By October, no, by September 30th. Oh my God, that's exactly a month. There's, we might have to drive to Dallas. I heard if you go to Dallas, you can get them done. Steel, Brooklyn. All right, y'all, this is Toasted Shimmer. I've been so boring on my eyes, but I'm in such a good mood because of my horse. Um, that one just my eye look. I can't with myself. I'm out of control. Somebody do something with me. Yeah, that's what I heard. But getting Chase to take off work to go to Dallas to do it. So then he can take off work. He has to take off work for a whole week. I want to cruise with... Um, the Trim Fit Company. I don't know if I've told you guys that. Have I told you all that? Um, I won a week-long cruise. It's really not a week-long by the time you, like, cruise and stuff. But, because it's, like, Monday the cruise leaves at, like, 4. And um, you're back Friday, like, super early that morning. But it's to the Bahamas, which is on my bucket list. And so I was like, we are going. We are going. We were, we were trying to plan a trip to Mexico. Cause it was our 10 year anniversary and I was like, look, I want us a, I want us a cruise. You don't have to buy a vacation. And with Southwest points, I can fly. Hey, come here. I can fly for free. However, the flights are terrible. So I need to look at, um, another company and see how much it would be. It might be worth it to fly someone different. So I'm super excited, but I just grabbed this passport because they just sent me the stuff to fill out. And I'm like, you have got to be kidding me that his passport expired in April. So that's the first thing on my list today is figure out what in the dog crap I am going to do about that. <sighs> Stressing me out. I know Cheryl's passport's up to date, so... Cheryl can go with me. She's tickling me today. Guess my kids are playing because they're acting fine now. I don't know if y'all could hear them, but it was like, it was aggressive sounding. All right, I did the raspberry glaze with toasted shimmer, so nothing super bright. But the pink is on my lid, and then the brown is obviously on the outside. It's really pretty. Nothing crazy, but super quick, easy. Because now I'm stressing out. I just started thinking about that passport thing. And I just started stressing out. Straight stressing out. What? They are just like yelling. Playing something. What are they doing? Somebody's at the source. They see my ring camera's going nuts. You look like you love me. Do you ever have days where you have like 100 things on your list, but you really don't know what you should do? Oh, someone said I should name the horse Post Malone, which if you see this horse compared to our other horses, it totally fits. Like he's such a cool guy, but he, he looks nothing like the other horses. And I was like, oh my God, that kind of fits. Perfect. I'm not like a big Post Malone fan, but I think it fits so good. That I was debating it. So I've got to come down with a name. The guy needs a name. He loves his head to be scratched right here. I found that out on the floor. I'll go take a picture of him today. I gotta go. He's got like um a fly boot rubbed his foot. It's been like this since dad got him. And so they've been doctoring it. And so I need to go doctor it. I didn't have the medicine with me when I I walked to go feed this morning because I was like, oh, it feels so good. I'm going to walk out here, walk to my mom's, go feed. And then I realized I didn't have the medicine. Right? He's turning country. This horse, like, doesn't look country. Like, it doesn't look like, like, Brecklin and now Chase's horse. Both are just like Sarles, like your basic, what you think of when you hear horse. 
And mine is like sexy, y'all. He's so good. I'll take some pictures of him. I know I posted pictures last night, but I'm going to take some more. Um, he's just so big and so muscular and so pretty. And he's, um, he needs to put some weight on. So I'm like, oh my gosh, he's going to look so good. People do not feed their horses enough. I don't know where he came from. I don't know where my dad got him. But every time dad gets horses in, I'm like, why do these horses look starving? You guys, you should not see your horse's ribs. Like, they're supposed to have big bellies. But I get it. It's expensive. But so many of them come in and I'm like, oh my gosh. These people don't take... Dad's always like, Kaylee, not everybody feeds their horses the way we do. And I'm like, well, good Lord, did they feed him at all? Or just put him on... You can't just put him on grass. I mean, some you could. But... So when he gets filled out, y'all... Oh, he's going to be so cute. I Right, Nicole? I should have a sexy horse. I agree. I love it. I love it. Sometimes I'm like, man, you are so dramatic. And I'm like, I can't help it. It's just who I am. Like talking to myself in the mirror like, you are so extra. Oh, y'all want to see my hair? I got my hair done yesterday. I need to take it out of this clip. And then I just talk to myself and I'm like, you just can't even help it. I try to be basic sometimes or like normal because I'm just like not normal in anything and sometimes like man it would be nice if I could just chill and just be chill and I just can't <laughs> does anybody else feel that way I mean Stacy Clarkson feels that way but does anybody else like if everybody does it or likes it I then don't like it like I like stuff so different but this horse is, he, um, his coloring is obviously, like, what made me fall in love. But he is so calm. Both kids got on him bareback last night. He's very calm. And he is, like, Chase roped on him um, the couple days I saw. And he's just perfect. Chase thought he was too slow. He's like, he's lazy. He's slow. Which is what I loved. Which will be perfect when Steel or Brecklin. I don't know that Brecklin will ever rope. But Steel surely will rope. And um, so he will be perfect for him. If you're in the market for a horse. Let me just say this. You guys quit buying them so young. And buy them older. Aren't they good? People keep talking about my lashes lately. And you know the crazy thing is. Um, I just saw the gap. I have not even been using my grande lash that often. It's just this fiber. So that primer I put on has Capixel. So that's why they're staying healthy and long. It's this fiber mascara though. This fiber mascara is on point. So I was talking to someone about, I'm like, I loved our mascara before, but this stuff, holy crap, it's good. So good. Taylor, are you ready for the lake weekend? The nice rainy lake weekend? Has anybody looked up the weather to see what the weekend says? Are we getting this weather all weekend? You look like you love me. All right, y'all. Love this combo that we're about to do. Pink peony, which is my blush. It's fajita. Night. I know. I got to go get the stuff. I'm going to get the stuff. It is fajita night. I, this is the type of friend I am. Y'all, speaking of me not being extra, how people, like, don't invite themselves over. I don't know if Chrissy told you, uh, Taylor, but I was like, so I'm thinking that Tanner can cook fajitas one night and then Chinese one night. What do you need me to get? <laughs> I know that that's not normal. I know the other people don't just, like, volunteer their friends' husbands to cook and invite themselves over. I know it's not normal. I don't know why it's not normal. I feel like it. But, yeah, she sent me a list of groceries yesterday, so I'm going to go get them. That's on my list of things to do today. I'm going to go to El Rodeo and get the good stuff.
Yeah, we don't. Uh, I'm going to go get it all, Taylor. You just show up. You show up. Look at that. Pink peony and chilled pink. And then we're going to put this juicy pink plumping gloss. Uh-oh. I got a sexy horse now and some sexy lips. Y'all better watch out. Friday is about to be rocked. And then let's see. My hair, I don't feel like it's sexy. It's like MILF hair. MILF hair was the wrong word. Mom hair. I was thinking I was a mom and got my words all confused. It's definitely not. MILF hair to me is like a bob. But I definitely am in my mom era with my hair because it's growing. Look at it growing though. Look how thick and good it's looking. I got it blonder, but also with some like streaks. I wanted some like streaks. I can't go very warm because my hair is so mousy. So I can't do the, um, like the warmy reds that I like. I can't really do. They don't look good on me because my roots. I love them, but Taylor says no. She says I can't. And blue nails. Watch out world. I am ready for my pink and white nails to come back. If we're being honest, I miss that because when these grow out, which these don't look bad now, um, I did break one though. I broke one working on this new project I've got. So I broke this one. But I hate how they look when they grow out, which again, these look fine. But when they grow out, I do not like the look. I had to get this, y'all. Look how cute that is. In fact, I'm going to like put it on here because I'll probably want it. But my hair is growing. I am getting so many baby hairs up here. I've been drinking two collagen a day. Um, for a minute now and it is working. I knew it was working because my leg hair, my face hair, my um my leg hair, my face hair, and my nails. Couldn't think. And when we did my hair yesterday, you know, I've been wearing it curly every day, so you can't really see like how much thicker and good my hair looks now. Oh, so good. So I don't no extensions for this girl. We're growing it. We are going, I don't hate the length it is, um, so not normally my style, but I'm not hating it. Uh-oh, Christy's calling me. She's probably telling me to get my butt off live. Oh, hold on. Hmm. Let me text her. Y'all, I have a feeling it's because she brought me feed, and I wonder if it's going to rain. Hold on. How do you, I don't know how to do this phone, y'all, or this watch. Text Christy Ash. I probably should not be curling my hair, huh? Hey, I'm still on live. Y'all, it just sent the weirdest text to her. She's going to be like, what in the heck are you saying? Uh. What is going on, y'all? Is it raining in Lawton? Do y'all know? Christy was bringing me. I'd asked her to bring me feed. So she might be calling to say, hurry up and get this feed out the back of my truck. Is it raining in Lawton? Stacy? Stacy should be the Lawton by now. I'm just throwing some random curls. Because I'm like, the store just opened. Surely nothing crazy is going on there already. The ends of my hair look super curled. I don't really know why. Probably from the shower I took last night. They're probably going, wait, did Lindsay leave some stuff? I have no idea. Ask Cheryl. I am not sure about that. I talked to Lindsay, but just for a minute. actually talked to her about protein balls you guys if y'all have not been going to elevate remember I used to go to elevate and get shakes all the time 
um, the shakes and the teas, like, I lost a bunch of weight on Herbalife um, back in the day. So I swear by it. If you do it consistently, it works. Lindsay owns Elevate. She's the girl doing a lot of Botox at the store now. She is a RN. And she helped deliver. Still Ryan. She is a, she was a baby nurse. So she didn't actually do the delivering part, but she was there, obviously, for me and for the baby. Um, I love her, and I trust her with Botox. Um, she's so good. Anyways, she owns Elevate Nutrition, and they have been making the best damn protein balls. Oh, my gosh. So if you're like me, I was like, oh, I'm tired of doing the shakes. But these protein balls, I can do my, like, down the hatch protein shake in the morning. But as far as a meal replacement, I'm just not in that area of my life. Um, but if you are, go to Elevate. They're great. And Cy and Aaron work there, and they're awesome. Um, you know, you like to go places in the morning where the people are nice. They're super nice. Anyways, even if you don't do Herbalife, you need to go buy and grab some protein balls. Oh, my gosh. So yesterday, I was like, we bought, Cheryl got the powder. You can buy the Herbalife powder and then make the protein balls at home too you just buy the powder from them and then um or you can just go buy like i'm probably gonna do today and they're like six bucks for four which i'm like you probably can't make them for that at home So anyways, it sounds like Brie is there, and I don't know what they're looking for. I'm guessing Botox, but I don't got it. I'm going to order some zinc. Brie has told me for a year to get on zinc. Um, my Botox, I don't even, like, it's not setting. I don't have wrinkles, thank God, because of my skincare, but we have tried all the brands. It's probably because my caffeine intake and my metabolism is so high right now. Um, this did happen to me when I was um, doing Herbalife. When you start eating healthy and, like, doing all the things, your body starts metabolizing stuff. Like, my metabolism is on point. <laughs> but that's also why I can't drink. If I take a drink, then, you know, I get sick. Same thing. Um, so, if you have those issues, there's really no way to solve it. It's a good problem. You're doing, you're being healthy and being good, and your body doesn't want the bad stuff so metabolizes it <laughs> but my body I'm like body I need the Botox because I don't have wrinkles because of my skincare I've reversed them I used to but I want the Botox so I can't do this and create them the Botox uh, paralyzes those so you don't have the movement which is what creates them so I am like tripling up all summer on skincare because I realized that my Botox was just not setting I'm feeling cute today. Where should we go? We're going to figure out this passport thing. Let me put some jewelry on. Can y'all believe my husband's passport's expired? What am I going to do? I'm going to get online today. I had started an online deal for the kids. Um, and I'm going to finish that today. Because I was going to pay to take the kids with us. Well, you can't. So it'll just be me and Chase and... Which will be fine. The kids don't need to miss a week of school. Um, so, I will have somebody stay at the house with the kids. It'll be totally fine. I mean, Brecklin doesn't think it's totally fine. I think it'll be good for Chase and I. We've been married 10 years. Get us a little week-long vacay. Neither one of us have ever been on a cruise. I would never book a cruise, to be honest. And, um... I honestly had no idea until I got the email that I won the cruise. I knew they were doing a thing, but I was not paying attention. I don't like look at stuff like that um, because I talk about trim and supplements because I freaking love them. Yes, I make a commission off them, obviously. Um, but I wasn't paying attention or ever thought that I'd be anywhere close. And so when I got the message that I won, I was like freaking shocked. I um, like... The makeup company, you know, that I sell, Synergence, you have to have people under you to ever win anything. So, I've never won a trip or anything like that. Oh, look how cute the pink is with the pink. Oh, you know what I debated, but I was like, oh, it's too much. I debated my pink shoes, and then I was like, mm, and I did these, because I think that's just, I think that would make me look like I was way older than I am. Don't do the pink with the pink. 
but the pink jewelry I think is really good. All right, y'all. It is Freaky Friday. We're kind of changing Freaky Friday to Game Day Friday. So, um, Stacey will be live with some Game Day stuff and Kylie later. Also, we're going to do another hat bar live today. We're going to do a hat bar live like every day. They're Y'all are eating them alive. And um, she has a bunch of hats to make because basically most of them sold from yesterday. So, we need to make some more. So, all right, girls. Thanks for hanging out with me. And um, pray that I can get this passport done today. And everything else I was going to do, I felt too cute. I was going to work and get dirty, but I'm not going to. I'm going to go to the grocery store and get the stuff for our weekend dinners. And I hope you all have a good Labor Day. We will be running some fun Labor Day stuff, so check your email, your app notifications. Make sure everything's turned on. And have a fun and safe Labor Day. If I don't see you, I'm sure I will, though. All right, y'all, bye.